Hello everybody, this is the Alcanigma. Today, we'll be getting every single achievement in Castle of No Escape. There are a total of 10 achievements in the game. TrueAchievements.com puts this game at 2-3 to three hours, and I personally completed it in about 5 hours. The first 3 achievements we'll be dealing with all have to do with the chests in the game. Whenever you open a chest on any of the 6 floors, there's a random chance to get one of several things. Some good, some bad. You'll notice, by the way, that this game is almost exclusively RNG. Anyways, sometimes you'll find a better weapon in a chest, sometimes better armor, and sometimes the chest will just explode, dealing some damage. All three of these net you their own achievements. The next three achievements are extra objectives to keep track of on a run where you also beat the game. You'll also have to win with all three characters for other achievements, so that pairs up quite nicely. The first one, Friendship Wins, is pretty straightforward. Don't attack anything that isn't Nikolai. This means avoiding contact with all enemies as much as possible. Utilize flares where appropriate, and pray that you happen to find the lamp. The lamp will automatically illuminate all adjacent squares in a cross pattern from your current square for the rest of the game. This makes a monumental difference in avoiding unnecessary risk. Other than that, your dexterity stat determines the odds that you'll dodge an attack. The higher the better. I Know The Way has you win without using the crystal orbs. Using the orb has a chance to reveal one of the gem's coordinates at the cost of one strength. It's ultimately unnecessary to use the orb, so you should get this no problem. For what's next, use the orb after you've collected all the gems. Just fill up all the slots on the right of the screen, except for the one meant for the lamp, and then go use the orb. This achievement can't be done on the same run as I Know The Way. Face Controller, Bits and Bites, and Papers of Pain have you win with the three characters. There's nothing really unique about them except for their starting stats and max stats. All of their runs play out the same. Hope you find the lamp early, find all gems. After that, open all chests and read all books. Go to the trader and buy the potions to further raise your skills, prioritizing intelligence most of all. After that, fighting Nikolai consists of casting Webb, then attacking him until Webb wears off, then rinse and repeat. You can tell if Webb is in effect when a spider web is over Nikolai's picture. Remember though that you will die if any of your stats reach zero. If you're low on intelligence, stop casting Webb when you get down to one. You'll just have to hope you survive long enough to finish him at that point. The last is Untouchable, which has you win without taking any damage from enemies. The bandit is your best bet here since he has the highest base dexterity. Other than that, you'll almost certainly need a lucky run that gets you the lamp within the first floor. It took me about an hour and a half to get a good enough run. Once the run is alive though, the tactics are the same as a regular run. Find all gems, then open chests and read books, go to the trader and buy potions, prioritizing intelligence. When fighting Nikolai, cast Webb and only attack him while Webb is active. One clean run later, and you've completed Castle of No Escape. Thank you so much for watching. If you found this video helpful or want to see more videos like this for other games in the future, please leave a comment down below. And if you want to be notified when more videos like this are uploaded, consider subscribing and giving that bell button a powerful flick. Thank you again for watching and, uh, bye.